Dear traders, welcome to FX Mentor and I am here with the new strategy that is especially for the beginners and even you can use it as an experienced trader. So this strategy as I have mentioned it is basically for beginners because it is very simple and straightforward in nature because it gives you very easy signals and in a short period of time. So guys, well, let's talk about the strategy. So first of all, I would like to say that you are going to use this strategy on the 15 minute time frame. And I will explain you that how you can pro properly get the benefit by using this indicator because this is indicator based strategy. Right now you can see I am using the USD CAD 15 minute chart and you can see that we are into the downtrend. So what happened you can see here we were below the moving average you can see a downtrend. Again we were below the moving average a downtrend. Above the moving average we have the upward trend and then again below the moving average we have another downtrend. So this is not only it's working on USD CAD, you can choose any pair of your choice and you can enjoy the long trading because from the 15 minute you can prefer to do day trading as well and you can also prefer to do scalping. Now look at this pattern guys because if we talk about the USD CHF above the moving average you can see a very good height and always when the market comes near to that line it gets a rejection you can see some pens from below okay so that's why this strategy is very powerful because as per the author of this strategy the strategy is very powerful and you can hold your trades for the longer period of time and i am also saying that you can add up the scalping as well let's have a look how it has performed today on gold so here we have the downtrend it was very fine on 15 minute then the trend gets changed and you can see a straight upward momentum and here we also had the downtrend when it comes below the, this moving average and you can see a straight downward trend so overall you do not want to i'm sure that uh, as per my lectures that i have already given on youtube I always tell you that do not trade the slow momentum so if you look at the candle size the candle size is very small so it's not good for trading right let's have a look on euro USD okay right now if you look on euro USD then you can see that just one hour ago we had our down signal sell signal and you can see how swiftly the market is going down and here we had a buy signal the market is up let me tell you which indicator is this this is 15 minute day trade crusher f henry 0331 and the name is f henry 0331 and it has 355 downloads you can download it on the trading view let's have a look on the other pairs that how it is performing so guys uh, when i talk about the indicators it doesn't mean that you just have to blindly follow all signals because if you ask me then i have already highlighted you that within a trend you have to follow the signals like I have made the trend line kind in, in the form of arrow. You can see this is the upward trend. So what I personally do is this. I will take the buy signal. I will ignore the sell signal. Then again, the market comes above the moving average. I will take the buy signal. And right now you can see the sell signal is running. I will also ignore this one. And once the market again comes up above the moving, uh, moving average, then we'll go to prefer into the buy position. Similar is the case with the gray wooden pound JPY. This is the uptrend. Okay, this is the up uptrend. So if I ask a question from you, should you take a sell position? So it will be completely wrong. Because even if you look at here, we had a downfall below the moving average, but it doesn't stay well. Uh, below that line again it pumped up so this is always a risk that when you're trading against the trend then you can uh, get a negative trade so let it come again above the moving average then go for the bullish trade as per following the trend okay now li like on AUD JPY you can see uh, here we had an upward trend then down then market again come into the upward trend so when the bearish signal will come ignore it and then when the bullish signal will come then you can trade this pair so this indicator is very simple in nature i have highlighted you you can see buy with the trend again buy with the trend and ignore the sell positions and you will be very successful and hopeful with this trading indicator strategy 
so guys what do you, how, how do you like this strategy please must mention into the comment section and we are also coming up with the new indicators and we will talk about the new strategies as well moreover guys i would like to say that please join the exnus broker the best honest regulated broker the link is given in the description of this video i personally use this broker so please support fx mentor by joining this broker thank you very much